Padres versus Marlins. We're at bottom of the sixth inning. This one's brought to you by DraftKings. We got our guy, Miggy Rowe, up versus Musgrove, and that's a fastball just off the plate. The count is 1-0. Next, a little cut fastball. They say that one caught the plate. 1-1 one one slider right down the middle. That's a pitch that Miggy's going to want to jump at. They're going slider again. This time they want it outside, away. They kind of get it. little slash stays alive. Oh, doesn't do it that time. Another slider. Let's see. Shakes off the fastball. Says yes to the slider. 2-2. Two, two. Outside. I actually think that was a cutter. I think that was a cut fastball. That's the slider. That's the same hanging slider he got last time. That's bombed off the wall. Profar grabs it. Throw, throws it. Doesn't throw it. Doesn't throw it. Waves. Throws it. And Miggy Rowe gets a triple. Our dude, always hustling, has a podcast on the network, Rose Rotation. They're driving, they're steering, and Profar's like, damn, shaking his head. Now, everyone was like, what the hell just happened? What was that? And the one TV announcers, they thought maybe he was challenging them. And watch the uh, split screen here with Profar, maybe getting a little bit too cute. Go ahead, run. He's saying, go ahead. Go ahead, Miguel. Take off. Yeah, so they thought maybe he challenged him, like, I dare you to run on me, and then and then threw him out. But no, that's not what happened. What happened was the shortstop, you see him right here, Kim, he runs over to cut off as if they're going to try to hold him to a single or get him out at second, which is just the wrong base to be covering. And Profar sees him over there, and he waves him like, dude, that's not the play. The, that's an easy double. The play's to third. Get over there. So now you see him run across the screen to get into spot. A play in, in live time. So you see the hit. See the shortstop run as if the play is going to be at second, which it's not. You concede that double, and you just make sure he doesn't get to third. And it's really funny because while Profar is telling him, dude, you're in the wrong spot, we're supposed to throw this to third to keep him to second. While doing that, they allow him to go to third. And there you go. Because Miggy sees the weirdness. Turns the burners on, and the ball actually beats him, but the tag doesn't. That was a cool slow-mo shot. So now Rojas is on third, and they got the infield in, and Jacob Stallings hits a grounder right up the middle. Does that score Miggy Rowe if he's on second? Maybe. Does the infield get that if they're back? Maybe. Don't know. Not going to be able to figure that one out because it didn't happen. Profar's like, all right, well, that led to a run. Damn. wonder if he's mad at himself. Or he's frustrated with Kim for not going to, go, going to the wrong spot. Don't really know. But what's interesting is that after Musgrove gets out of the inning and they all head to the dugout, there's a whole powwow. Manny's getting on him a little bit. Uh, maybe not getting on him, but just letting him know, like, dude, you got to throw that in. Got And he kind of turns. Maybe he doesn't like the tone in which Manny gives his advice. We've seen that happen before. Manny's kind of a tough love guy. You know, it's brotherly, but it's a little tough love guy. Where Musgrove... He's also coming up with some tough, tough love. And this is him. It's his. He's the pitcher. He gets the run added to him. He comes over and he just says, uh, don't fucking do that. Just throw the ball in. Come on. Come on. We're good. And then Manny's talking to him again in Spanish, so I don't know what he's saying. And then Soto, the new member, he's going to talk to him, puts him under his wing. And he's like, listen, man, my guess at what he's saying is like, just throw the ball in. Because one, you're kind of showing up your teammate that he went to the wrong base to cover. Two, you let the runner advance anyway. So just pocket that. Talk about it in the dugout. And just throw that ball just so you throw it the full way. And Profar says, yeah, all right, cool. Appreciate it. Goes over to Musgrove, says, hey, man, I'm sorry. Shouldn't have done that. Musgrove, hey, I got you, man. I got you. We're all good. Later on in the dugout, he's thinking about it, and he's kind of like maybe letting it eat at him a little bit. So Machado comes over, makes him laugh. And we're all good. And he says, I just have to throw it in. I made a mental mistake right there. I take full responsibility for it. It won't happen again. He's a young guy in the outfield learning. So everything about this situation besides the mistake feels like it was handled really well by the Padres. I like seeing Soto take him under his wing. I like seeing Machado make him laugh. I like seeing Musgrove be like, come on, dude, just throw it in. That's all. I got you. We're all good. And I like that DraftKings sponsored this video. I appreciate that very much. I like these kind of little ins and outs of baseball, obviously. That's why I like making the videos. Thanks, DraftKings.